join me in welcoming Mushtaq Chopra of the Citizens Foundation to the stage. share a story with you about a young 12-year-old boy who in one of our schools is talking to the principal about how he wants to pay his admission fee in four installments of five cents each. And our, one of our co-founders is happened to be there and he was curious. He wanted to know. He said that, uh, young lad, this is not such a large sum of money. Why does not your father pay for it, the full amount? The boy comes and tells that, sir, my dad is no more. I have a mother and a seven-year-old sister. So, the, the founder comes back and says that your mother must be working somewhere. Why doesn't she pay? Again, he comes back and says that, sir, my mother is blind. What do you do to make ends meet? I, the boy says, I have a small ice, uh, snow crushed ice uh, shack and I sell this ice cone and I make five dollars in a month and I make enough to maybe bring three naans for breakfast but there is only one naan at dinner time and our, my, our blind mother keeps on asking us, their children, have you eaten? I've trained my sister to say, yes, ma, go ahead, we have eaten. So this is a situation which prevails in a lot of poor homes of Pakistan. Now think about your own experience, the happy times you have had in your school life, all the good things you've learned, all the good friends you've made, your teachers who have been instrumental in molding your character. And now we come back and see what do we give to society? I and the five entrepreneurs came up and we said that we want to give these children a formal schooling system. So these children can have an opportunity to be someone or something in life. By the grace of God, today TCF has the largest network of schooling system in Pakistan. A large number of TCF boys and girls are in tertiary colleges today. TCF is the closest proxy to what the government could be doing had they had a pro proper management. We have set the standard for reforming the education sector in Pakistan, and we will continue working towards it. This brings us to today and the huge challenge of achieving scale. We recognize that merely building more classrooms cannot keep pace with the population. We have two options. We can work with the government to reform the public schools, provided the management of school is merit-based, or we can work through the private sector directly. Over the next year, we are developing a business plan for franchising a primary education system that can be adopted by other low-cost entrepreneurs to help them set up small neighborhood schools. At the same time, we find an opportunity 
at our doorstep through the Skoll Foundation. I am happy to announce that the TCF will be working with the Khan Academy to help our teachers improve content knowledge and address the scale challenge. <laughs> During our 17-year journey, we have made beautiful discoveries about the human nature. The TCF story is one of faith in human spirit, in the overwhelming goodness of human beings, and in resilience and perseverance, and the confidence that the future will be brighter than today. Thank you. And I wish that uh, we can all have the compassion and the, in, you know, it's very infectious what uh, Ms. Lennox said. You know, it, it really moves me gives me goose pimples. I think we all social entrepreneurs know that. Thank you so much.